The U.S. Air Force USAF, plans to purchase 26 E-7A AEW and C aircraft, Reuters reports. The aircraft will replace the role of the aging E-3 Sentry AWACS fleet. Meanwhile, Boeing in a release on February 28, 2023 stated that it had secured a US$1.2 billion United States dollars contract to work on the new E-7 AEW and C aircraft for the USAF. Contract work began with the development of two new variants of this aircraft. It is slated for the USAF to receive the first aircraft developed under its rapid prototype program in fiscal year 2027. This means that the USAF will receive new features or extensive work on the aircraft. The E-7's Northrop Grumman Multirole Electronically Scanned Array Mesa, radar provides a fully integrated command and control node, said Stu Voberl, vice president and general manager of the E-7 program. It is the only advanced aircraft capable of meeting the short-term Air Force early warning and control requirements of the U.S. Air Force, enabling integration across joint forces, he said. The E-7 is capable of simultaneously tracking multiple air and sea threats with 360-degree coverage via MESA sensors. These devices provide soldiers with critical domain awareness to detect and identify enemy targets at long ranges and dynamically adapt to emerging tactical situations. Currently, the E-7 is in service with the Royal Australian Air Force RAAF, Republic of Korea Air Force ROC AF, Turkish Air Force, and British Royal Air Force RAF. The E-7 is based on the Boeing 737-700 commercial aircraft. The E-7A variant was introduced in 2009. The aircraft can track and provide data for air targets in real time and will be able to control and direct individual aircraft.